the Moyne Thrust Belt is a linear geological feature in the Scottish Highlands which runs from Loch Erebol on the north coast 190 km southwest to the Sleet Peninsula on the Isle of Skye. The Thrust Belt is a zone between an extensive landscape of rolling hills over a metamorphic rock base to the east and more rugged, terraced mountains with steep sides sculptured from weathered igneous, sedimentary and metamorphic rocks to the west. Mountains within the belt display complicated layers and the width of the zone varies up to 10 kilometers. Often, summits of hard rock cap soft to sedimentary rock layers visible on lower slopes. Ben Morass and, in the center of the belt, is a typical example that rises from a glen of limestone caves up through sandstone terraces to a quartzite summit cap formation. The discovery of the Moyne Thrust in 1907 was a milestone in the history of geology as it was one of the first thrust belts discovered. The formation has since been reinterpreted many times. Eventually, the Moyne Thrust corroborated tectonic plate theory in that, during the Caledonian orogeny of the Silurian period, Scotland was compressed as a European plate thrust westwards over a thrust fault and above of the ancient Lewisian ice on the Laurentian plate. The thrust belt defines the boundary between the Hebridean terrain to its northwest and the northern highlands terrain to its southeast. The thrust carried metamorphic material over 200 kilometers across Scotland entirely masking the geology of the previous terrain. However, small windows such as the Ascent window and the Glenacle imbricated thrust system allowed geologists to estimate what their geology of Scotland was like before the Caledonian orogeny.